in these problems, we're looking for something called the reference angle. So a reference angle is the angle that's formed by the what they call the terminal side of an angle. So you know, when we're drawing an angle on a unit circle, we have this side, uh, and then we have the other side. They call it the terminal side. So let's say you had a 45 degree angle here. What's the reference angle? So it's the angle formed by this and the x-axis um, and the acute angle that's formed by this terminal side in the x-axis. And that is just 45 degrees. I mean, here's the x-axis. It's where we started this angle. Where it gets different is if you have an angle that's greater than 90 degrees. So let's say I had a 135 degree angle. Get rid of this line here. What is what is the reference angle? Well, now the acute angle between this arm of our angle right here and and the x-axis, it would form this angle here. So this would be our angle, and that would be 45 degrees. So those are reference angles. We're going to try to find a couple here. So we'll start with this one. What is the reference angle for 36 degrees? Well, 36 degrees is going to look, you know, something like this. Um, and it forms um, the, with the, uh, the acute angle here with the x-axis. So that's just 36 degrees. So less than 90, the reference angle is just going to be the same. So that's 36 degrees. How about 7 pi over 12? Now we're in radians, so we need to think about uh, the radians on the unit circle. I'm going to put in a couple of values here for reference. So we've got 0, we've got pi over 2, and we've got pi. So we're looking for the reference angle for 7 pi over 12. So let's, let's draw this angle in first. Where is 7 pi over 12? Well, 7 pi over 12, that's less than pi, right? Because that would be 12 pi over 12. It's greater than 2 pi because 2 pi, sorry, it's greater than pi over 2 because pi over 2 would be 6 pi over 12. So it's going to be just beyond pi over 2. So I'm going to draw it in like this. So there is 7 pi over 12. Now, what's the reference angle? It's going to be this angle here. And what is that? Well, if we've got 7 pi over 12 here and this part to get up to pi would be whatever you add to this to get to pi. And that would be 5 pi over 12, because 7 pi over 12 plus 5 pi over 12 equals 12 pi over 12. So this chunk in here is 5 pi over 12. And that is our reference angle. If they give you the angle in radians, you can give the answer in radians. So that is how to find a reference angle.